All right. Hello, Vic. How you doing? I'm fine. Thank you. All right. So today I wanted to just ask a couple of questions on uh, dead animal removal. So let's say someone, there's two ways to this, because the first one is, you know, near and dear to my heart, which is, let's say you have, uh, you have a pet and uh, they, they've passed away. Is this something that uh, we would call you and you would handle it? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So we, we definitely do provide that service and, and everyone's different. You know, they can be taken to a shelter or rendering plant. Um, sometimes people want us to take them to a, a pet cemetery or something like that to be cremated, those, those kinds of things. But we can transport the animals and, and provide that service for them. So you carry out their wishes, like if they want to go to the cemetery or do you, what do you do? Well, they, usually, they usually make those arrangements and if that's where they wished us to take it to, a lot of times they're not, uh, they're not ready, I guess, emotionally to, to deal with that. So they'll call us up and ask if we can just, you know, A to B kind of thing. Gotcha. And how about if, you know, I find in my backyard, I, I find a dead animal and, uh, you know, we need your dead animal removal services that is yeah that, that's no problem so uh you know we're, we're open every day so and, and that it happens every day we get those calls okay. um you know sometimes it's front yard or backyard sidewalk sometimes on the roof um a lot of times under a house or uh, in the attic a lot of times we're cutting them out of walls and then you know disinfect those areas seal off the openings and you know that's that's it it's pretty much a, a full service so it's not just removing the animal afterwards, you're, you're sealing off and you're disinfecting and, uh, you know, kind of doing damage control. Exactly. Exactly. Because if, if we don't seal off that opening, if, you know, it, it could probably happen again or it will happen again eventually. Some animal's going to find that hole and, and work their way in there. And if I have a um, dead animal uh, on my property, generally, how long does it take to, uh, for it to start smelling? Usually it's a few days. Uh, it depends on what kind of animal, how big, uh, stage of decomposition. There's there's a, a few factors in there, but uh, there's there's a lot of people that'll call us, you know, just to get a quote, and you say, you know what, we're we're trying to stick it out, and we'll call you if we need you, and then they'll call us a couple of days later and say it's ten times worse. Please come, <laughs> you know, that kind yeah. of thing. Yeah, so. I can't imagine there's a, you know, dead animal on my property. And I don't have any experience with dead animal removal. Like I don't want to get germs or where do I put it? You know, I don't want to bury it right. in my backyard. Who would I call? What would I do? So I'm assuming it would be a good idea to call a company, like a professional company to handle it from A to Z. Absolutely. Absolutely. Wherever it is, I mean, we'll, we'll do our best to find it. Some, sometimes they're not. I mean, it's, it's hard depending on the way the house is structured, especially if it's an addition a lot of times they didn't build an access into that part of the house. So we have to cut into the ceiling or in the wall or even cut into the floor. And then it's up to the homeowner. You know, sometimes they want us to cut to go ahead. And sometimes they're like, nope, I'm not going to cut into the floor. I'll just have to deal with it. You know, gotcha. but e yeah, either way, they can be pretty easy and they can be pretty difficult to locate and remove properly. Okay. And if somebody wants um, to get a quote uh, how quickly can you get a quote and get somebody out there generally? Oh, same, same day. As, as long as it's early enough, the call, then we'll get someone there the same day. They call mm -hmm. a little later in the evening, you know, it might be for the following day or something like that, but yeah, really quick. And what's your website address? Uh, allcityanimaltrapping.com. Okay. And anybody can go there, click on your email or uh, call you directly and they'll get somebody to answer their questions and get somebody out there as soon as possible. Absolutely. Awesome. Every day, yeah. Okay. Well, thank you. Yeah, no problem.